Hello and welcome to Home Cooking Spain. Today's lunch I'm going to be cooking stewed potatoes with mixed seafood. So let's begin. Okay, so we'll start off by turning this stove on. I'm going to turn it up to medium high. And I'll add in about one, three tablespoons of olive oil. And I'm going to chuck in some onion, garlic and peppers. The peppers, I'll leave a link in the description if you're interested to know more about them as they are frozen. Well, I froze them myself from fresh. Okay, so we'll wait for all this to nicely soften up. Okay, so once this is nice and soft and slightly brownish, what we'll do is um, I'm going to sprinkle my stock cube. And I'll also add in a teaspoon, roughly, of sweet paprika. Today I'm going to add some of this yellow food colorant, as I haven't got any saffron today. But this is more commonly used here in Spain than the saffron. It's much cheaper also. Some salt, about three tablespoons of tomato, fried tomato sauce, and I'm just going to add a bit of water, about half a glass roughly. I give it a move, and we'll leave it here for a couple of minutes so that everything mixes in and dissolves correctly. Okay, so after a couple of minutes or so, I'm going to add, a, add in my potatoes, which I've cubed up in a bit, a bit larger than bite-sized pieces. And I'll add in the water just under half a litre, just enough to cover all the potatoes in and I'll give it a mix and we'll turn this right up and leave that there to boil for about 15 minutes or until the potatoes are soft and I'd better cover it up so that it doesn't splash everywhere. Okay, so about 15 minutes have gone by and wow, this is looking really good. You can see that the sauce has nicely thickened up and the potatoes are perfectly al dente. So the next step will be, I'll just turn this down to Number, get mixed up here, number seven, and I'm going to add the frozen seafood in. And let's move this around a bit. And this has stopped the boiling process right down. And obviously, there's some water coming out from the clams and as it was frozen well you know more water which is what I wanted so I'm gonna cover this back up and I'm gonna leave it there on number seven medium high for ten minutes and then it should be ready right so ten minutes have gone by look all that steam and this is smelling fishy. 
so let's turn the stove off and we'll just wait that, for that to cool down a bit and then I'll dish it up I'll leave it opened to one side well and here you go today's delicious lunch ready for eating and don't forget the bread well many thanks for watching and hope to see you soon goodbye